babes, welcome back to the channel. So as y'all can already see by the title, um, today I'm gonna be showing y'all how y'all can create your own custom jewelry cards um, to save money. Um, I know a lot of small businesses don't have the money to be, um, you know, having your vendor to print them for you or anything like that because they do, you know, get a little pricey. But I'm going to be showing y'all how I create my jewelry cards. Um, and I'll show you what they look like when my vendor sends them to me. Um, and then what they look like once I, um, you know, fix them up. So this is what they look like when my vendor sends them to me. Um, you know, that brown. And this is not my business color, so... I really don't like that, so I just make it into my own, and this is what they look like. Um, you can design them however you would like, but I'm going to be showing y'all how I design mine and all that good stuff. And I just want to say excuse me for looking busted in this video. I know I'm looking heck of crazy, but um, yeah, it's like late at night and... Yeah, we ain't gonna be getting dressed up. Anything to show y'all something. And most of the time, y'all are not gonna even see my face. Um, so yeah, um, I'm gonna be showing y'all how, you know, you can transform your packaging from this to this to, you know, putting your own little personal touch to it. And, you know, making it branded versus not branded. I mean, you can always um just slap um your logo on you know this but it's not my colors um and stuff like that and i actually like these um then that they have you know the dates on there and it has like a little background history of you know of your sign or whatnot but like i said it's just not of my colors so I'm going to be showing y'all how y'all can create y'all's and all that good stuff. So, yeah. For the little chopper to into this video, don't forget to give a thumbs up. Comment down below if you are new. Hit that subscribe button and join the Pretty Girl Crew. We're on the road to 2K, so just hit that subscribe button if you're new and you like what you see here. And also, um, don't forget to check out my business Instagram. I will have it on the screen, and I will also have it down in the description box so just make sure y'all check it out and also don't forget to check out my website um i just added my v-day um lash what is it my v-day lash pack bundle deal um to my website so just make sure y'all check it out it comes with all six of my lash styles it comes with the free mirror it comes with tweezers and the spoolie so just make sure y'all check it out shop all that good stuff and I will have a code for y'all on the screen as well. Um, I will have it on the website on the screen. And I will also have it down below. So just make sure y'all check it out. Shop all that good stuff. Once I write into this video. Okay, babe. So you would do your designing part on Canva. Canva is a free designing app. From there, you would upload your design on Avery. So you would type in www. Uh, avery.com slash uprint and i use the three inch square which this where this is where you see me uploading the my design or whatever but um yeah i'll i'll probably do a separate video on how i design it because i didn't want this video to be super super long but yeah, I'm just finding my picture that I designed on Canva, and I'm just uploading it on here. Um, now, I didn't make it the full three inches because the size of my, um, my, what is it called? The clear adhesive paper. Um, well, the clear adhesive packets are not like I don't want them to be like too big so I made them a little smaller than what they are and then once you got your perfect size you want to save your design and you want to click on print um, and it'll take you to this page and then you just you know whether you're on your computer or whatever or on your phone that's how you would print 
what you'll need um what type of paper you'll need to print your um jewelry cards on it's cardstock paper um and i just got regular white cardstock paper um you can use whatever works for you um and cardstock paper don't cost that much um i get mine from walmart from michael's from hobby lobby um they even have um i believe cardstock paper at the dollar tree is not as high quality as um you know the quality that you would get from other places but um yeah and i think they have it in like little different colors as well so um yeah we're gonna go ahead and print it and i'll be right back Just printing out. I got my scooby in the way, but it's printing out. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, and uh, gotta move quickly because my phone is about to go dead. Normally, I will use my little um cutter. Actually, let me grab my charger and then I'll be back. I put my phone on the charger so it won't go dead on this. But this is what it looks like. Cute, cute. And this is Capricorn, so we're gonna just breathe, package it. And normally I would use my little paper cutter thing. Or should I use it? No, I'm not gonna use it. It is very easy, but like sometimes it don't cut exactly where I want it to cut. So I'm just gonna do it this way because I feel that this is much faster. Um, even though when I cut with the scissors, it's not as straight, but it is what it is. Um, no one will be able to tell. And um, this is so inexpensive and it's like really, really good because people just normally just throw stuff like this away. They don't keep it, so you're not um you know spending a lot of money so that's why i decided to do it myself rather than have my vendor do it because you know they be charging so much nowadays and don't nobody got money for that you know and when you're starting a business you want to like save as much money as possible because if you're buying all this stuff you're not going to be really making any money so you want to save as much money as possible you know what i'm saying so i mean if you have the money you can do that but yeah i just like to save money as much as i can and if i can do something on my own then why am i gonna pay someone to do something like this for me when i can just do it on my own so that's just how i feel about it you know but um so this is what it looks like when I cut it out. Like I said, it's not straight, but yeah. video and then I'll do the rest later off camera because this video is already going to be super super long What you want to do? 
don't cut along, but you want to go in the in the corner and cut, but not super super deep. Okay. It's just a little bitty cut. Let's see. Just a little cut. You want to tape the back of your necklace down to make it stay in place. And I just try to push it all together. All together. And then together and then I'm gonna put the tape on there okay. it's just how the back looks it's taped and then this is how it looks We're gonna use that same bag that it came in and I just turn it sideways because um, it's big because I didn't make them the exact size so what I do I just push them push it all the way over like so and then I'm going to fold it's So from this to this. Okay, now we're gonna do this last one, and then we're gonna be done. And in this video, because I know this video is gonna be super, super, super long.
Alright babes, this is the vintage look. Um, they are super super cute. Um, yeah. Um, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Um, if you would like to see more videos like this, then just comment down below. Um, I'm always creating my own packaging um, for stuff like this. Um, you know, because it's cheap, it's affordable, and I, like I told y'all, if I feel like I can do it, um, then I'll do it rather than paying someone to, you know, create something for me. Though, um, paying someone, like, you know, I could have sent them this design, and, you know, they could have actually been on actual jewelry cards in much better quality, but I think I did a good job. And um, just for now, um, I'm going to continue to make my own packaging up. Comment down below if you are new. Hit the subscribe button. And join the Pretty Girl Crew on the road to 2K. So make sure you hit the subscribe button. Join the Pretty Girl Crew. Join the fam. You guys, whenever you subscribe to my channel, you are becoming a part of my family. So make sure you hit the subscribe button. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye. Mm -hmm.